All right. Hello, guys. Hope everyone's doing good. Hope your week's going well for you. Thought I'd do a quick video, and this is probably something that may not be new to people, but I think there's been a a, a little bit more interest in Void Linux lately. And maybe you've tried Void, and you notice if you use Firefox, some of the font rendering font rendering is really horrendous. Not what you see here, it's on the DevOn forum. Looks really, really bad. Here on Distro Watch, it uh, looks pretty bad right there. Over here, looks bad. So I was going to show you something really quick to help you improve your font rendering on Firefox on Void Linux. And of course, I'm using Agrium OS <clears throat> from my friend Jose. And actually, the answer is in the actual uh, documentation here. It doesn't say that this is what this is for, but this is actually what you need to do. You need to make a sim link of this font right here into your etc fonts config.d uh, folder. And then you need to just do a reconfigure of your font config. So let's look at that real quick. Now here's it says to do a sim link from this. So let me pull that up. And that is 70 no bitmaps. And there it is right there. And we're going to sim link it over here into etc fonts conf.d. And as you can see, there is no 70 no bitmaps cont file. All right, so let me do that. So first thing I'm going to do, first let me copy this. And I'm going to use a little trick that Cherry Bow told me that I was never even aware of. I don't know why my mouse is flickering. That's the first time I've seen that happen. My computer probably can't take all this <laughs> that's going on right now. <laughs> so I right click to copy that and I'm going to middle click. Well first I'm going to uh, become root. And now I will middle click. Bam! Thanks Terry Bow. Oops, I didn't copy the whole command, did I? Oh dear. Copy. Let me go back. And I will, there we go. You can do it, Dan, you can do it. So I'm gonna hit enter, that's gonna make a sim link. And next we are going to do our font reconfiguration. Bam! And it's rebuilding the font cache. So while it's doing that, I'm going to close this. Uh, before I do, let me show those again. Oh dear, it's already better. <laughs> I thought I would have to close the browser first. Oh well. Look at there, it's already better. Now I do have, let's look at Distro Watch. Look at there, that's much better. I do have uh, if you look in my first, look, there it is right there. It copied it over. Let's go back to ETC fonts. Oh, I don't have it in there yet. Never mind about that. I have a local .cont file that also helps with, uh, you know, how the fonts look. But I also have in my home folder 
this X resources file. And all I have on there, now I'm running open box. So this is this is my anti-aliasing X resources. So I'm gonna have to put my local cont file back into ETC fonts. But I'll do that after the video. I just wanted to give you that little hint. I will leave those uh, I'll actually if YouTube will let me, I'll leave those commands in the description. But I'll also link to the page there on the void documentation. All right. I hope that helps some people. And I hope you, if you're using void, hope you enjoy it. It's a fantastic system. I really enjoy using it. And you guys take care. All right. Thanks a lot.